it's been reported that Ashton Kutcher treated his now wife, Hollywood star Demi Moore, to a takeaway burger on their first date. The 32 year old actor ate the meal from a nearby fast food store with his future wife on a piece of land that he wanted to buy. He said we were keeping things secret at the time, so we couldn't really go out. So, how important is the venue on a first date? And how easily we impress. Why are you laughing at that? Just the old idea of you can't go out, so you sit on a field. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> absolutely. No, I was just picturing them. Know. You know, gorgeous Ashton Kutcher and Debbie Moore, not pregnant, sitting in a field eating a burger. I know. I'm starting to think, is okay. that for real? I know. Just stay inside <laughs> if you don't want to be seen. Anyway, yeah. for, for you, yeah. I mean, how important is the, is the venue um, the first date? Not really. It's the man behind the venue or the man inside the venue that's really important. You know, my very first husband, my very first husband, I had many, <laughs> not many, <laughs> um, he took me to the local Indian restaurant on our first date and yeah. I loved it. I actually still go there now. But with my new partner, I, I met when I was sort of living in a world of excess. I was choreographing videos. Every day I'd be in Detroit with Aretha Franklin, New York with Whitney Houston, France with Elton John. So my life was sort of excess. So when I met my partner and I was doing a Freddie Mercury video and he wanted to just go to the cinema and then just go to a local cafe, I was so grateful mm. because I just wanted to do something real, something ordinary and get my feet on the ground. So the venue, venue no, really but matter. it is the person that's taking you to the venue. You don't want too much showing off either, do you, really? No. Because, yeah, I, I, I was started going out with this guy once and he said on our first date he offered to take me to um, this really posh London club called Annabelle's, which is, I mean, really posh. Really posh. And I thought, no, that's just... Uh, might have to, I might have to wear a prom dress and, he might wear, <laughs> and, he, and I might have to dance opposite him like that, you know, while we're on our first date. And I just have these visions of us in a, in a sort of like, nightclub with, and, you know, and imagine him having like shoes with white socks and, you know, <laughs> and a blazer because you have to wear a jacket in there. And I thought, no, 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 no. So I just, you know, I said, let's just go to a, to a restaurant. And we went to quite a raucous restaurant in London, actually, where I knew it would be all right if you had too much to drink and, and fell out of the door. <laughs> so I think you've got to be, on a first date, you have to be really comfortable. Yeah, so, relax. Yeah, with Mark, we just went to local places, the same, just really yeah. local, just on our own, local pub, nothing impressive, nothing flash. And, you know, it, it, it works like that. You I don't want to be It can be obsessed. something really simple, just like having a, a bag of chips on a park bench. You know, as long as you're in nice company and, yeah. you know, it doesn't really matter where you are, a picnic or but something. it depends where the chip shop is, yeah. though, because the chips might be really cold <laughs> by the time you get to the <laughs> That's really not very vocal. <laughs> 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 I was going on my very first date with a very gorgeous blonde boy, and I'm going to date myself now because it was to see Psycho in oh. the cinema. With a really frightening, frightening film. We were on the back row. <laughs> <laughs> you know what that means. Oh, it's snogging time. <laughs> so anyway, so I've got a big thing of popcorn. Now, in those days, ladies had a lot of hair, you know, like a lot of bouffant hair and everything. And I got the popcorn, and he got his arm around me. I thought, oh, any minute now. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I don't know what I thought he was going to do or where. <laughs> but anyway, so when we... But then the bit came, you know, when he goes in, pulls back the curtain. <laughs> The popcorn went up like that, <laughs> over like that, and in to the lady's bouffant hair and stuck all over her. Like this, and I went, God, oh my God. I'm thinking this <laughs> <laughs> it was the funniest thing. So I, I Did didn't you see, see him again? No. I, I was wondering. Yeah. <laughs> no, I never saw him again. No. <laughs> okay, or her. Uh,